Okay, so here we have some printed artifacts. Show us, Jeff. All right, so this is a, um, a kind of rubber uh, type material. Uh, is In this case, it's Ninja Flex. Um, we've developed a new type of extruder for this material, which can swap onto the TAS, called the Flex Extruder. And this material is awesome. This is only this is really kind of thin, two extrusions with slide. It's a really, really robust, burly material. You kind of just do whatever you want to it, and the, um, it's really strong. It feels almost like a car tire type of rubber or something. So we might talk about printing out small rubber tires. <laughs> yeah, you can do a small rubber, rubber tire. Here's an example of uh, with an octopus with kind of a hollow head, squishing him, and um, it's a pretty awesome material, a little bit thinner. That's here. that's uh, this one is hollow. Same. It's the same. Yeah. So it has a hollow head in them. Oh wow. Um, uh, similar material there as well. Mm -hmm. And then uh, mm -hmm. in this case, we even have. Uh, I can show it a little clearer here. Um, this is actually ABS on the outside and then the rubber material on the inside. So you can actually combine the hard and soft plastics, or rubber plastic and a hard plastic uh, in a dual setup um, and print the same thing. And in this case, we have ABS, a hard plastic on the outside, and a honeycomb infill of urethane so we can uh, drop, uh, drop this and it functions just like a, uh, a, like ball. a golf ball.